Hello my friends, Valentin the Drones Reviewer is here. Today I want to make a range test with my DJ R2S in sport mode. Let's see how far uh, can we get to this drone back and forward, both forward and back. We have home point updated satellites. Okay. Let's take off. Take off. Home point updated. Okay, battery is fully charged. Trying to gain some altitude. Let's see around. Thirty meters. Thirty meters. Excuse me. And let's see how far can we get with this drone. Uh, at uh, 50, maybe 48% rate of charge of the battery, I will get this drone back because uh, it's uh, getting dark and uh, I don't want to have any problems and uh, find the drone. Uh, the speed uh, is not very high, uh, it has some front wind. But uh, I hope I can reach at least uh, 5 kilometers in this uh, sport mode. In normal mode, the maximum distance I managed to reach was about uh, 7.3 kilometers, you can see in my previous videos. But uh, as I told you, it's getting dark and I don't want to have uh, any problems and uh, assume the risk. Okay, sensors are off. Transmission dual band. It's not a the wind is uh, very calm, it's a breath of wind, but uh, here where I'm standing, I don't know where the drone is, uh, how much it uh, affects uh, the fly, the flying of the drone, uh, the wind. As you may see in sport mode, the battery drains uh, a lot uh, quicker than uh, mo normal mode. I hope uh, when I get this drone back I will have some tailwind. It is normal to have tailwind because uh, at this moment the wind is blowing uh, towards me. Yes, uh, the wind affects the speed. I will try to push the drone uh, at least 5 kilometers. Maximum transmission distance uh, for this drone is about uh, 12 kilometers. Uh, I don't know how DJI uh, calculated this uh, distance because in real life uh, you can uh, reach at let's say 10 kilometers but uh, the battery won't last uh, uh, very long to get the drone back uh, safe and sound I, uh, since i have the drone i didn't try this because it's uh, very risky i'm in an area with a lot of interference battery level is low We'll Aircraft this. will return to the home point and, uh, in 10 seconds. As you may see, 
it's a lot of uh, words and a lot of interference and uh, that uh, affects uh, the quality of the transmission signal okay as i told you at five i will get this drone back i hope uh, i get the drone back i will have uh, full speed Okay, getting this drone back, I don't want to risk it. As I told you, this uh, is the maximum speed, because uh, the drone now has tailwind, which is uh, great for me. I don't think uh, there will be any problems. I was a little bit afraid uh, to get this drone uh, far away because, uh, as I told you, it's getting uh, dark uh, very fast and uh, it's uh, quite cloudy, as you may see in the image. It uh, expects to be some showers in this evening. Okay, the drone is getting back at full speed. This is the maximum speed of the drone in kilometers per hour and in meters per second, 90 meters per second. This is the maximum speed and in miles per hour, 42.5 okay kilometers we have 68 we have three kilometers more left and 32 percent of the battery i think there will be no problem let's see how the battery looks it's quite balanced okay 50 cycle count Now I see the battery left is around 20%. I think I can uh, reach uh, in sport mode 6 kilometers, but uh, uh, as I told you, it's quite risky. Uh, today was a perfect day for flying, no breath of wind, but uh, I will do this uh, another day. I'm a very uh, used. I'm very concerned about uh, these updates uh, that uh, DJI is trying to um, involve us because uh, in the past months uh, one update uh, almost killed my my drone. I managed to get rid of the uh, last update that the DJI um, developed. Uh, I don't uh, recommend to update the last uh, firmware because uh, uh, the last firmware is not uh, very very uh, good for DJI R2S. I'm talking only about DJI R2S. 
is not any improvement and uh, okay get this drone return back return to home and if you update to the last landing uh, firmware critically low battery you will warning not uh, be able to to roll back uh, when you desire i'm not using uh, last firmware i will show you what firmware i i will use uh, for uh, now and uh, furthermore because uh, as i told you the last firmware does not improve any at all the flight and others okay the drone has landed as i told you i will see this is the aircraft firmware i use i recommend this firmware because you can roll back and any times you desire uh, i don't uh, recommend uh, the last firmware it's a piece of crap so if you like my video please uh, share and subscribe to my channel valentin the drone server was here hope to see you soon at uh, next time in another exciting video best uh, regards and uh, happy flying ciao